Hello friends. Hope you're all doing well today. I'm here with Liberty Rising Wellness Services and my name is Ruth O'Donnell. I'm a functional movement specialist. I teach yoga and I'm a Reiki practitioner as well. And what I'm here to do today is to offer you a self-care tip that's easy to use anywhere. Um, needless to say that we are living in um, uncertain times and maybe even if we're pretty well adjusted, we might not really even notice that our breathing can be compromised. And so um, one of the things that happens if we are uh, breathing in a way that isn't, isn't natural and restful is that we use smaller muscles, we call them, uh, we call them accessory breathing muscles that aren't really designed to be used at rest. Um, and so a couple of those muscles are in our neck. And when we massage these muscles, we can get some pre relief pretty quickly. And it really feels good. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your fingers uh, and you're going to make like these little uh, lobster claws, like pinchy claws. You can use two fingers or you can just use your index fingers. And then we're going to go and you're going to locate on the side of your neck behind your ear. There's a bone there. And there's some long stringy muscles, kind of meaty on some of us, and they go all the way down and they attach here on our collarbones. So you can kind of feel the tendons of those muscles. So take your lobster claws, and then you're going to go and find the tendons and where they attach. What we're going to do from here is we're going to gently, but still firmly, work our way Finding um, these muscles, you can kind of rotate your head right and left. Find those muscles and give them a little pinchy massage. I want you to go all the way up to the, where the bone meets. You can even kind of gently push on the bone there. And it kind of feels, you, you start to feel like maybe like how a dog feels when it gets like pet and stuff. You're gonna, it's gonna feel good if you're, if you found the sweet spot. So you want to try to get the meaty part of those muscles. Let's just take a couple of rounds up and down the muscle and just notice if you feel like some tenderness in there. If you do, that's a really good chance that you're overusing these muscles and breathing because you might be uh, shallow breathing or stressful breathing without even realizing it. So let's just take a couple more rounds up and down um, and moving around. Yeah. You might even have the impulse to take a nice deep breath because those muscles relax. And then just go ahead when you make your last round down to the bottom where the tendon meets, you can kind of Pull gently on the skin there, and that might feel really good. You might want to just spend a little time pulling on the neck. Feels really good. And then go ahead and let your hands relax and shake out your hands. Put them on your knees or on your lap in a comfortable way. I invite you to close your eyes if you're comfortable doing that. If not, then just drop your gaze and fix your gaze. And take a few breaths and notice if you feel a difference. And so you can do this anywhere. Um, I encourage you to do this frequently throughout your day, maybe right when you wake up in the morning, especially before you go to bed at night. But anytime you feel that you're a little off and you might not even be realizing that your breathing patterns are compromised. And um, so that's your quick tip for the day of self-care. And uh, remember that uh, you can trust yourself. You're your primary health care provider and you have everything you need right inside you. And I'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take good care.